the great thing about the Mountain Ridge um, team of 2014 was that this team wasn't created just in 2014, but they had been playing together since they were eight years old. And we saw the evolution of these athletes as, as the progression of each season took place. And as they started to be in, um, all stars, you could see there was something in the making. What I would want those athletes and what I wanted them to know is that, look, it is just a game. Um, and, and that uh, that's not what's gonna define us. What's gonna define us is how we react to that event that took place. Right. And what will define you is how you respond. And as you can see these young men, how they've changed in their lives and what they're doing now, that moment there just made them better. It taught them life lessons that, you know, sometimes you will get cheated in life, but you don't get down and stay down, but you get back up and you work harder and you pursue those goals that you have, whether that's in baseball and any type of sport or just in life in general, career aspects or being a parent or a father or a mentor in society. Those are all just as important, if not more. I'm not much of a player's coach. There's those ones that there that, you know, just kind of give them free reign, let them run, and then when they're, they're expected to play at that time and then show up and play. But we, we implemented some rules and some policies, and, and there were some challenges during the process, but you never get a second chance to make a first impression. And we tried to let those kids know that, that everybody is watching. Um, we were representing the, the city, the world, yeah. the city of Las Vegas. And, you know, we're known for glamour and glitz, but now we were able to put you know, a mark on Las Vegas of that there's young athletes that are coming out of this town that have morals and values and they're willing to represent the, the community the way that they did. I'm a native to Las Vegas. I've been here for what, 41 years, coming on 42. That's something that's really important to me. I've grown up here and this town has provided many opportunities for my family. You know, we came from humble roots on the east side and we've been able to be provided many great things. And, and with that being said, it was the least I could do to this community. It's just a way to give back. You know, there's a lot of things that we can do as individuals, but this was just one, you know, opportunity and we took advantage of it. And because of that, it was able to put a mark on this city, this town, and the field of Mountain Ridge. It's amazing how time flies and how life changes in the, in the process. What I would like them to be remembered by is just like the motto that we had on the back of our shirts. It was always earned and never given. Um, I think that's something that they've developed in their, their personality and their traits is they're still working to this day, whether it's in sports, schools, life in general and I think that's what they want to be remembered by as well it's not just that moment in time but look what I have become because of that time that I that I was in I would hope that they have learned from that experience that there's there's more to life than, than just the game of baseball um, that they were and they have been and it's proven and the proof is in the pudding of, of what they're doing and what they're participating in that they need to realize that that life isn't just about the game of baseball but it's about you know, progressing and, and taking advantage of opportunities that are given to them, you know, working hard in school and making a difference with those people that you come in contact with. As well as mentoring, you know, there's a lot of kids, especially in this league and leagues around here, that look up to these athletes, even they still fall into this day yeah. and they pay attention to their stats or to what they're doing. And when they notice that they're doing those things that are good, they're good quality people, they're good quality athletes and they're mentors. You know, and that's what athletes should be, they should be, you know, positive mentors.